this video, we show how to set up a Mitsubishi Electric Communication Gateway. Mitsubishi Electric Communication Gateway is compressed of System Controller Connector and Fixation Turret, Configuration Microswitch explained forward, and Mitsubishi Electric AC Unit Connector. To plug the communication gateway on the AirZone main controller, use the turret supplied and the connector on both elements for a correct alignment. Align and press until it is firmly plugged. Connection must be done without power supply of both AirZone system and AC unit. For the connection of the AC unit and the gateway, on the gateway there is a connector dedicated for the cable supplied. Plug the end with the corresponding connector. On the side of the AC unit, look for the connector CN105 or CN92 and plug the other end of the cable. After connections are completed, see installation sheet to set micro switches so that it matches your installation, if there is a bypass damper or not, or the number of ventilation speeds available on the inter unit. Microsuite configuration modifies the information exchange between the AC inter unit and the airsoul system looking for a better performance. Once connections and configurations are completed, power supply, AC unit and the airsoul system at the same time. You can visually check the correct working of the airsoul communication gateway through the LEDs in it. Airsoul main controller communication LEDs that are blinking while there is active communication with the airsoul main controller. AC unit communication LEDs that are blinking while there is active communication with the AC unit. Power supply LEDs that it is fixed every time the gateway is powered up and communication gateway activity LED that is blinking every time it is powered up. Upon connection and checking are completed. Thanks to the QAdapt functionality you can even configure the ventilation speed selection map so that the Ventilation speed can be adjusted more accurately to every installation.